Hi Virgo, welcome to Catch It Up. On my YouTube channel I do you um, weekly love reading from the 10th through the 16th of May 2021. Keep in mind Virgo, this is a general reading, probably what not resonate for all of you. But if you do like my channel, please like, share and subscribe if you want. I would be very thankful and grateful to support my channel. Cross watch, of course, you're also welcome. Please don't try to force a message. You will know if this is your story. Of course, you can switch your roles if you want to, but I read the energy. Then, if you want to have a prior reading with me, you find all the information on the description down below. Keep an open mind, it's on the side for your person. Uh, you find all the information on the description down below, and then something else. Um, I will put first your, um, your, um, the energy for your person, and then I do yours. And now for you, it's release your ex and your person has keep an open mind. Your soulmate may different from your usual type and expectation. And you, uh, you side the time has come to clear your energy. Wow, forgiving and learning here on the news. All right, something here is moving, something you need to know or you have to know or you're going to find out that you probably, you, the best thing to do is to relax, relax, release someone. Uh, seven of Pentacles in their side for your person. Want to invest, want to but wait for something, probably a justice system. They're waiting for to come towards you because they're only sleeping well without you, um, Virgo. They're feeling very worried what they should do also, if they should invest, if should if should um, wait or if you wait, because they um, they close now an old karma cycle to start something brand new with you. Probably they're waiting for you, that you are, uh, you are going to divorce or release something from the past and they need to open mind, to be open mind. Underneath the page of wands to take action with you, uh, they want to be with you, but again, they know the probably cycle uh, and cycle end here to start something new. Old cycle here, or they had to uh, wait until a cycle it's time to start something new with you. Um, now your side, Queen of Pentacles. This is for me, you and Capricorn, and uh, no need, no one to uh, be happy. You're very good by your own, also um, Virgo. A uh, very practical person, very someone with um, a sense of uh, multitasking also, having everything under control into your life, feeling very, very secure on yourself, create a lot of things by yourself, probably could be also an, um, a business owner, having a lot of strength, courage to make him forward or need to have some story, um, strength to move forward, nine of um, wands, probably you don't know if you can trust the situation, like don't bother me, world. You know that at end, uh, a cycle needs to be end to start something new, could be that end, that they are you waiting for them, but also could be that you need to end something that they are, can come in to offer the cup of love. Underneath the king of cups, Pisces energy, showing love but not so much as used to. Let's see what's going on. Probably because you need to and and you need to release your ex means that you need to uh, divorce for someone before you can start something else and they're waiting that you can release your ex so they can come in to offer the cup of love. Um, seven, um, the seven, three of swords, seven of wands in reverse, feeling very they are in pain without you, Virgo. Uh, they are also trying to let you understand that um, they don't want to be always defensive, uh, but like more time it's passing by and more um, they have no patience to wait for you because they want to be with you like crazy. Um, but they know also they need to have be open mind to go with the flow. Uh, justice with the um, Ace of Pentacles, again, of this, this justice system or this law, um, something here is waiting for um, to be divorced or something here to 
having justice, they were coming in again with something beautiful, like with a gift, and to offer you something. Wedding bell. Uh, nine of swords, please. Six of pentacles in reverse and the four of swords. They don't want to wait. Uh, they, want, they, they know they need to be patient, but they know also that probably you need to fix something or they again have to fix something and because they are, are probably give right now to someone else, they have to until something is adjust here to come forward to you. But these posts that they have with you, they are making them crazy. They are very, then going nuts. Uh, give me the wheel of fortune, like they would think about you day and night, day and night, they would, would talk, think about you, wheel of fortune with the knight of cups, they can wait that this cycle is over, this karmic uh, cycle, so they can come to you, and again, I see a lot of offers, uh, ask me what you want Virgo, I give it to you, <laughs> give me the ace of cups, the ten of cups, look at that, ace of cups with the ten of cups, they want, I told you, they want to give you all, it's unbelievable, Virgo, what you did to them. <laughs> and you're standing here like, okay. <laughs> Give me the Queen of Pentacles, please, for my Virgo. Queen, King of Swords, Page of Wands. Uh, you're saying, uh, you need to have patience. Let's have patience because I need to release something before I can uh, move forward with you. Um, and yes, you need to have a lot of strength for you also, very good, probably you're not showing that so much, um, but you're in love with them also. And they see you as a lovely person also. Give me the nine of wands. Hmm, the six of wands, <laughs> again, you know that you have a lot, a lot of victory with them and success, and you love to have attention, but you're not showing them. Like you're trying to play cool right now. Virgo, you try to play cool, but inside of you, move. Oh, that was wrong. Give me that wall, please. Yeah, the six of swords. Knowing there's something here, because yes, you are, you want to be with them also, but, um, with the Four of Cups in reverse says that to me that you are open up to them. But again, they need to wait until something is adjusted. Or they need to wait anyway. <laughs> I see them, they're waiting. But I don't know if it's you, that you have to release a, um, someone from the past, means um, separation or divorce. Or they need to wait and you have to wait that someone have to release the ex. Someone has to release the ex, divorce, or the um, separation is going through here and so when everything is done a new saga can begin yes a new saga can begin and um, they're going nuts they are thinking about you day and night and you also but the only thing that you're not showing that to them and uh, you can wait that way the way it's uh, done and that's why, um, yes, I see here someone is very, very impatient, very nervous about the situation also. But I want to put one card in your side and then one in, on the person's side. Yeah, Virgo, Virgo, Hermit. You are, uh, it's like you have patience, but you know, because you know what you're going to do and press underneath. It will be great, be very beautiful. Still have patience, you know? Someone it's soul searching, having patience. I know everything will be fine, everything will be good. But uh, like, we will have our time. Now let's put a part of the Virgo side, the person of my Virgo. And they see you also as a very obsessed with you, very uh, mature person. Look at that. The emperor and the empress. Now you tell me, Virgo, this is a counterpart. Wow. Ooh, wow. Unbelievable. Bellissimo. 
fantastico, wow, they see you as a counterpart, that's why I told you, they can't wait anymore to be with you, they see you as everything, all right, very good, wow, let me know please if this resonates, wow, holy cow, what a reading, thank you so much for being here, enjoy your week, oh yes, take care, stay safe, and bye-bye.